2018 Honda CRV review. Always an intelligent choice, the CRV offers welcome doses of polish and pizzas for 2018. The Honda CRV was redesigned not too long ago and, frankly, they we were surprised by how deep modifications went. Rather than phone in certain superficial tweaks with a top selling model, Honda gave it a ground up overhaul that decisively parted ways which consists of predecessor. The 2018 Honda CRV sets a different pace due to the rivals to follow along with. Among the tricks up this fifth generation CRV's sleeve is usually a turbocharged engine that comes on all trims excluding the base LX. With ample low end torque along with a fuel sipping design, fuel economy climbs as much as 34 miles per gallon highway. In line with EPA estimates, the turbo engine is really a natural easily fit into the CRV. The 2018 Honda CRV also gains advantage from an overhauled suspension that reduces body roll in corners without compromising its historically compliant ride. The wheelbase is longer top and rear tracks are wider, plus there is even an additional 1.5 inches of ground clearance in case you found that the last CRV scraped its stomach many times in light jutty off-roading. Our wheel drive remains a possibility for those mild excursions to the dirt, along with increased stability in wet weather. Inside, the CRV follows the most recent Civic's lead having a modernized dashboard, a digitally enhanced instrument cluster, along with an updated touchscreen that thankfully features a physical volume knob. Fears also more legroom compared with earlier models with an exceptional 75.8 cubic feet of maximum cargo space which enables the supposedly compact CRV the best alternative to mid-size SUVs. Add all of it up plus the CRV is usually a strong contender for best in class honors despite tons of competition from crossover rivals like the more rugged Subaru Forester and also the more athletic Nissan Rogue. Notably, we pick the 2018 Honda CRV as one of best family SUVs and best small SUVs because of this year. What's new? Comprehensively redesigned a year ago, the 2018 Honda CRV carries over unchanged were torn between X and also the EXL. The latter has desirable luxury features for instance leather upholstery, a programmable power lift gate along with the premium speakers. We liked it enough to get one for the long term test fleet. But do you require those amenities within your compact crossover? If you only need a practical utility vehicle, the cheaper X offers generous popular features of its own including a sunroof, also it comes standard concentrating on the same turbocharged engine plus a 7-inch touchscreen based infotainment system. Trim Levels and Features The 2018 Honda CRV is provided in four trim levels, LX, X, EXL and Touring. The LX isn't exactly bare bones. Nonetheless it does have a less powerful engine along which is a 5 inch display and no sunroof. Step up to your X so you get a standard sunroof including a 7 inch touch screen, an electrical driver seat along with a more powerful, turbocharged engine. The XL tax on items for example leather, premium audio plus a power lift gate, whilst the touring goes all together with LED headlights, a subwoofer plus more. Opt for the bed space LX and you also have a decent roster of exercise machines, including a 2.4 litre 4 cylinder engine 184 horsepower, 180 pound feet of torque paired to your continuously variable automatic transmission and front wheel drive, a digital parking brake, 17 inch alloy wheels, LED running lights, automatic climate control, cruise control, a height adjustable driver seat a 5-inch color LCD dashboard display, as well as a 4-speaker speakers with Bluetooth and USB connectivity. Honda's various advanced safety technologies are not offered within the LX, although all-wheel drive is optional as on all trims.
the X ups the ante having a more powerful turbocharged four-cylinder engine 190 horsepower, 179 lbft, remote start, 18-inch wheels, fog lights, heated mirrors, body cult door handles and spoiler, rear privacy glass, a retractable cargo cover, keyless entry and initiate, an aftermarket driver information center, a sunroof, dual zone automatic climate control, an electrical driver's seat, and heated front seats. Infotainment features such as a 7-inch touchscreen with Apple CarPlay and Android audio phone integration, satellite radio, an aftermarket rear view camera with dynamic guidelines, numerous advanced security measures automatic high beams, blind spot monitoring with rear cross traffic alert, lane departure warning and intervention, adaptive cruise control, and forward collision warning with automatic emergency braking and secondary USB charging ports. The XL's upgrades incorporate a programmable height power liftgate, driver seat memory settings, leather upholstery, an electricity passenger seat even though it lacks a height adjustment, a leather wrapped controls and shift knob, an auto dimming rear view mirror, with an 8 speaker sound system with HD radio. A navigation strategy is optional within the EXL but not about the lesser trims. The top of the line touring boasts LED headlights, dual chrome exhaust tips, roof rails, automatic wipers, hands free functionality with a power liftgate, ambient interior lighting, a navigation system, and also a subwoofer for the stereo audio. Aside in the EXL's optional navigation system, there won't be any factory options with the 2018 CRV, therefore, the only real question is which trim level suits you. Trim tested. Each vehicle typically also comes in multiple versions which are fundamentally similar. The S with this review use our first drive with the 2017 Honda CRV EXL Turbo 1.5 liters in line 4, CVT automatic. FWD Driving With capable in any other case thrilling acceleration, composed handling and the confident highway manners, the turbocharged CRV is usually a multidisciplined competitor. If you're looking for a little SUV that will not make compromises due to the size, this Honda has a great balance. Acceleration Small displacement turbocharged engines often struggle in SUVs, although not the 1.5 litre engine inside CRV. It's quicker than most rivals, providing good low end OM for scooting through city streets. You won't be nervous using a freeway on ramp, and you also won't need to slam about the gas to pass through slow pokes. Braking. Owners will quickly realize linear and progressive responses from your brake pedal during both flight and hard stops. In our emergency braking testing, the CRV's best stop from 60 miles per hour took 116 feet, which falls consistent with what we expect from compact SUVs. Steering Steering resistance builds naturally because you turn the wheel, giving the CRV feeling of precision and confidence. The wheel also returns to center smoothly, ensuring stability for the freeway. A stand out in side class. Handling. The CRV strikes an admirable balance between handling and ride quality. Mid corner bumps, as well as other road irregularities, don't upset it, and the entire body roll is minimal. You can confidently snake up a curvy road without sickening your passengers or unnecessarily triggering the soundness control. Drivability Continuously variable automatic transmissions often feel strange, though the CRVs is probably the best. Excel from a stop feels natural, but full throttle acceleration feels a little odd since the engine speed remains constant. Cruise control doesn't manage speed going downhill, to annoyance. Comfort The CRV's ride is quieter plus much more supple than ever before, and accommodations for front and back occupants are spacious and welcoming. You may hear some engine noise while Excel up a freeway on ramp, 
Nevertheless, the sound falls around the pleasing side with the spectrum. Seat comfort. The power driver's CTX models or over provides eight-way adjustment plus four-way lumbar, ensuring a fit for drivers of all sizes. You won't hear complaints during long trips from your back seat if you do not have someone within the center. Alas, just the driver reaches a just seat height. Ride comfort. The CRV consists and settled over just about any kind of surface. Impacts happen once that is it, thanks simply to fluid-filled suspension bushings and Honda's decision to settle with reasonably sized 18-inch wheels. Fears a good amount of tire sidewall to absorb the bumps, producing a smooth ride. Noise and vibration. You'll notice some wind and tire noise. Nevertheless the engine is simply noticeable once you step hard around the gas, plus it doesn't sound bad either. None of the USB ports is loud enough to drown out conversations or force occupants to improve their voices. Climate control. Drivers responsive to temperature changes needs to fiddle using the controls in excess of they prefer ever since the system fails as well at low settings. Heated front seats are standard on all trims except LX. Rear passengers will appreciate vents around the back of top armrest. Interior. The home design improves practicality and provides a welcome dose of favor compared towards the last generation model. Owners will appreciate little tricks for instance adjusting the opening height for the rear hatch for tight garages and venting all four windows on hot days by holding the unlock button. Ease beneficial. The physical controls are certainly intuitive, even so the touch sensitive buttons could be annoying. Some on screen buttons are small, and yes it's too all too easy to graze the touch sensitive volume control around the steering wheel. The digital temperature and fuel gauges flanking the speedometer wash outside in sunlight. Getting and jetting out. The wide front and back door openings provide a lot of head and leg clearance about the way in. The CRV is often a little taller than before, however it remains just as an easy task to step inside, overlapping doors with narrow sills help. Occupants of all sizes can have little difficulty entering or exiting. Driving position. It's straightforward to put the seat and tire right where you need, as well as the gauge cluster is all too easy to see in the entirety. The armrests to use equal heights, but what appears like a pad for one's right knee is in fact hard plastic, that happen to be uncomfortable for the longer-legged. Roominess. Never mind the compact much of this SUV's class. Interior size is generally greater than those of rivals, with exception of front head and leg room, that happen to be by no means tight. Rear seating space could be the biggest you can find in a little SUV. Four full-size adults will fit with zero problems. Visibility. The windshield's pillars don't obstruct your front view. Plus it's very easy to sense leading bumper's location. Blind spots are minimal, and monitoring is standard on all even so the LX. Rear headrests encroach slightly within the rear window try not to obstruct. The backup camera covers a large viewing angle. Quality. Flowing interior panels and trim inserts show generally convincing quality as also does the leather adorning the seats and tire EXL and touring trim levels. A well-built vehicle Atlanta divorce attorney's respect. Utility. The CRV can be a master of practicality. From its enormous and multi-configurable storage chance to its many clever compartments, this Honda enables you to question if the larger SUV is required. Small item storage. The reconfigurable center console features a deep storage well along with a sliding tray that's rubberized and textured. It also doubles being a cover for hiding small valuables. From large cup holders to your phone shelf and deep door pockets, there exists a place for the in your passengers items. Cargo space. 
at 39.2 cubic feet. The CRV's rear space for storage is at the top in the class, rivaling room in larger SUVs. The rear seats flip down easily and softly, expanding space to some massive 75.8 cubic feet. A clever height adjustable cargo floor helps you to choose between a designated loading surface or higher space. Child safety seat accommodation. All rear seats have easy to get to latch anchors. The large rear passenger area means baby car seats fit without moving the top seats. Outboard rear seats each of a tether anchor for the rear seat back. The center seat's tether anchor is inside roof, which often can slightly obstruct rear visibility. Technology with smartphone integration and advanced security features standard within the majority of trims almost LX, the CRV produces a strong case in some recoverable format. Alas, the entertainment system and voice controls might be annoying. But that does not matter much in case you plug with your smartphone, that's fully supported. Audio and navigation. Honda replaced the quantity slider using a physical knob, but other aspects from the touchscreen's menus still feel clunky and stilted. Smartphone owners with good reception might get navigation at no cost via Apple CarPlay Android Auto, just for them to think twice about acquiring the optional navigation system. Smartphone integration Android Auto and Apple CarPlay integration are standard on all but the bottom LX trim. Front and rear occupants get two USB ports each. Driver aids. Lane keeping assist, lane departure warning, adaptive cruise, forward collision, and blind spot monitoring are standard on just about LX trims. Collision monitoring throws the sporadic false positive during congested city driving, but a majority of systems are otherwise unobtrusive or easily disabled. Voice control. Standard voice controls are somewhat cumbersome, to ensure that it's often faster to rely about the physical or on screen controls. Fortunately, an extended press about the voice control button enables you to engage the advanced Siri or Google Voice voice recognition system whenever your smartphone is plugged in. Yeah. <laughs>